All right, here we are. <laughs> this is just something right in the face. <laughs> Welcome back to Ark Survival Ascended on the center. So we have our raptor. We have our grown-up raptor. I need to uh, give them a deal. Uh, there is one little difference if you don't know. <clears throat> If you have a dino that you tame by knocking out and letting it get back up, any babies or anything, they, they get levels. Any babies don't. When you tame a baby <clears throat> and get it, they don't get levels. So that's why this one is still 135 compared to this one, which is at like 201, which I think started at like 199 or something when we got him. So... There is that. Uh, didn't I make a another raptor saddle? I did. Also, there was the... You know earlier when we... Last episode when we tried putting this over there. Kept on saying in a way of a drop. Well, that drop came down. It was just a white drop. It had uh, this saddle in it. Um, this slingshot. Which is kind of cool. But I don't really need... And that's about it. It didn't have really anything else in it. Um, I think it had like a couple of like some thatch or some wood or some stone in it. But that's it. It didn't have anything else. So. Alright. And as you can see the uh, server rates aren't that bad. Um, I don't think I've changed the dino food thing. So the server rates aren't that bad for... Um, for their food consumption. This dude has got all of his gone though, so I need to give him some food. Do I have any like meat meat in here or is it all spoiled? I think it's all spoiled. Alright. Uh, so got to split this off here. Give him some meat. They have 1,200 health already, so I'm just going to raise up their melee attack. Also, let me grab, give them the saddle so they can be protected. Okay. So, I was going to whistle passive, which I keep on forgetting. Is passive the period or... Um, So Tract is the all-aggressive. Attack this target is period. Okay. All passive is semicolon. So that's this one, right? Yeah. Okay. And then if we want them to be... Um, want them to attack my target. Is equals? Yeah, that's, uh, that's not what that did. That's not what that did. Equals is aggressive. It's just straight aggressive. Okay, so I 
Okay. So it's not working like I thought, because if I push this button, they're set to neutral. So let me check this. Neutral is what? Hyphen, but that's not what I pushed. I mean, I guess it could be, but I don't think so. Why is pushing is does this do it? Nope. That just does the thing. Huh. And that puts them on neutral. Yeah, I'm I'm not understanding these whistles because they're not doing what they're supposed to do. The button I'm pushing right now. Is supposed to make them attack my target. Set them to attack my target. It doesn't. It sets them to neutral. So, yeah, I'm kind of confused. Because I'm pushing this button right here. Attack my target. Where's attack my equals? That's what I'm pushing. But as soon as I push that button, they go straight aggressive. Watch, they'll just start running around and attacking things. Yep. And if I don't automatically get them, they automatically just start attacking anything around. They don't attack my target. They attack everything. Which is not supposed to be what they do. They're supposed to only attack what I attack. So, yeah, I'm not totally sure what's going on with the whistle commands here. I know I can do this. So there's aggressive. Whistle attack my target. And it and then this one is it. So yeah, this is their the shortcuts don't work. The the key binds don't work. For what it says it does. It actually does not work. It actually sets them to being straight. It sets them to this. Not this. So yeah. Alright, so what I'm going to do real quick, I want, I'm going to run around and see if we can find a better Triceratops. This is like a level 20 or 15 or something. So let's go around and see if we can find a better. I need one more raptor and I can form the pack and use the pack attack, pack um, call. And what the pack call does, if you don't know, is it gives them... Um, you take care of him while I go over here and check the drop. So we got us a nice little green drop here. What we got? Um, ascended stone hatchets. Interesting. And some meat. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Um, 
I'm going to get rid of this one because it's the lowest one. I only need the one, but... So we got us some stone hatchets that are ascendant. That's nice. Yeah, they're still falling. I want to explore around, see if I can get a better deal. Morphodons. Yeah, we seem to have harvested them all, which is good. Get a little bit of weight in them. Guess they got the uh, 500 attack for right now. Let's see, there's a level up for me as well. I'm at 200 health, so I'm going to raise up my stamina here. There we go. Finally, we got another one. Level 95. Okay. That's a good one. What we got here? Level 55. And level 55. Alright. Okay, he's he's still falling. Come on. Let's just head over back to the pestle and then we'll try to get over here. Ooh, there's a tickle chicken. Let's go around the tickle chicken. Yeah, he's not falling anymore and didn't think he would be this far. But we can head over to... Uh... That's a blue dodo. That's a really blue dodo looking thing. But yeah, we can go back to the pestle over here. I need to get some I need to get some narcotic arrows is what I need to do. Then I can knock it out and use it. Get it up. He's coming. He's just a little slow. Their little follow thing is different. Uh shoot, the flyers are worse because they'll just they'll just fly everywhere. Flyers will just fly into your ass, you know, so. Alright, so I'm going to need to get some, um. Uh, 
Uh, I'm going to need to get some narcotic berries so I can make some trank arrows. Uh, stamina. Yeah, that's the one thing I don't have is the narc berries, so... They should be following me, yeah. Also, uh, I'm going to whistle, uh, I'm going to whistle neutral. Should be neutral, double check on them. Yeah, neutral. That way if uh, something attacks, they can attack. So I can do this to help me out. I can track how many I have. Hope to get like about 30 or so. It's going to take a while. I think it's two narco berries per narcotic. Okay. So what was it? It was five narco berries per narcotic. Damn. Okay. Stamina, please, and give me some. I can make seven arrows. I think that'll be more than enough. How many measure berries I got? This should be enough measure berries for me to um, do the thing. Switch this to trank arrows. This, I'm hoping, is enough for it to, uh, um, I don't know if it went off or not. Let me double check, because it's not making the sound. Yeah, it's not making the sound. There we go. Yeah, it didn't affect the dinosaur I was on, surprisingly, but... Is what it is. Alright, so it's noon. That sound is noon. Half of the day is gone. If you don't know, there are sound cues in this game for various things. So you could turn off the UI if you wished. If you remember the cues. I can't, so... I have to actually have the UI up and running. <laughs> I'm not that great. Alright. So let's go back over here to the um, Triceratops and try not to aggravate the tickle chicken. Because he will tickle us to death. I mean, I could probably take him with these two raptors depending on his level. If he's like a level 150, then no. Definitely can't do that. Okay, there's the tickle chicken over there. So we should be able to just walk past him.
I'm trying to figure out what happened with the Triceratops. And I hope he didn't despawn. He might have despawned. Yeah, he should have been around here if he's going to be around here or he's not. I'm going to head back over to the Tickle Chicken. He might be around the Tickle Chicken, which is going to be unfortunate if he is. It's not around the tickle chicken. Looks like they despawned, which sucks because that's a level 95. That's a pretty parasaur. Is that another parasaur? I saw a tail behind the thing. Yeah, it's a parasaur and it's kid. Looks like a drop is coming down. Damn. I was really hoping he wouldn't disappear. Or she. And now we gotta go look for another. Sucks, but oh, there's there's some over here. So let's check and see what this is over here. Oh, it's got a kid as well. It's level 85. What do we got over here? Level 55. What's the baby's level? I could just take the baby. It's level 85 as well. I could just take the baby. It would be the easiest just to take the baby, but yeah, I don't know. Let's, um, we can try. So let's see what we can do here. All right, I need to whistle neutral or whistle passive. Come on. Alright, so I have seven shots. Six shots. Don't you don't you do that. Don't you do that. Ow.
Problem is, is I didn't have enough arrows. Alright, we're just going to take care of it. We'll take we'll get its baby. I just don't have it right now. The ability to make enough narcotics to do stuff like this. Alright, grab the baby. Um, and now we have a trike. If people want to name the trike. So... I'm going to have to go kind of slow with this guy. Because he's going to be slow. Right. Um, rid of that. So I think I'm at like 200. No, I'm not there yet. I need one more point into stamina. Alright, so the trike... Still need to go back, grab some fiber. I think I'll have enough hide. If not, we can get some more. No problem with our default guys here. Uh, let's go. Let's go back around this way. Also, um, huh. What I need to do is I need to do this. What are you doing? Don't. Don't. What the hell are y'all doing? Oh, compies. Okay. Compies. Okay. Well, I feel better. Attacking my target. Attacking my target. You shouldn't be doing anything, because it's a baby. It shouldn't do anything. So that was the whole thing, apparently. Um, so what do I need to repair this? I need some fiber. I can do that real quick. I thought I could, but it doesn't want me to. There we go. I need some more fiber. Need to repair my uh, gear on myself. Let's see, I take this hide. Yeah, I have enough hide. <laughs> some keratins and that. Um, Let's get your attack up more. Because it was kind of low for the, rap the Triceratops, actually. Oh, he's pretty hurt, unfortunately. You need some... Oh, that's right. Hold on. Ugh. Don't step in me. Uh, you need some berries to eat. I don't want you starving to death. You're going to want care in 11 minutes. All right. Um... Let's do some repairs of things here. Um, repair that. Repair that. Repair that. And repair that. There we go. Now we got fully repaired gear. You're the highest level raptor. So that means you're the pack leader. The highest level raptor is the is what is the pack leader. So that's the one you should ride. Okay. I was wondering if he's going to attack my baby, but nope. He attacked the neutral.
a 140. <laughs> I definitely can't knock that out. I mean, I can later on. I can come back later on once I get this baby grown up. Um, how close is this thing? Oh, it's right here. Alright. So what we got? We have a Fioma saddle. A hide hat. A hide shirt. A hide gloves. And a hide hat again. Um... Oh, there's the baby. And he's just trying to follow the path. Not that great at it. None of them really are. Just need to go kind of slow for him. Hey, Dodo. Uh, let me go down here. It's be easier going through this section for him to follow. That's the dino that leveled up. Uh, if you don't know, the upper right, um, on the upper right of the screen is your dino that you're writing, and the bottom right is you always, so. It's unfortunate there's a blue drop out in the middle of the ocean. I don't think it's dropped yet, though. Oh, the tickle chicken is wandering around in a spot that he shouldn't be. Problem is, is I can take care of him. Probably. And I think I should. Of course, it would be kind of nice to tame him, but I'm not going to... I'm not going to try. All right, so what I need you to do is I need you to just stop following anything. Are we set to attack my target? Attacking my target? Attacking my target. Okay. I think I can take care of this guy. I hope. I might lose this other raptor, though, because he is kind of hurt. Eh, we'll try. He is a level 50. He hurt me pretty good. Alright. Yeah, he hurt me pretty good. Alright. Hurt both me and my raptor pretty good. I've lost half my health on this raptor and I'm pretty damaged myself. Um, let me see about let me see about getting some water in me. Come on. Drink. Can you, like, drink the water? There we go. Finally. Alright. But I got the tickle... I got the tickle chicken out of the way. It's only a level 50, so that helped pretty good. If I had a pack, though, I could have, I could have set like two or three of them on him, and me just stand aside. That's what I like to usually do with a pack of raptors. Have like three extras, two extras is my minimum, but three extras, and I can just uh, set them on the, um, set them on whatever I want to kill, and. Uh, and just stand out to the side to make sure I don't die and ready to run away in case I lose the raptors. Let me double check and see. How are you doing? Do you need care yet? No, another five minutes for care. All right. 
But we got our trike, hopefully. We don't lose them on the way home, because, you know, uh, like a T-Rex could just show up like yesterday. <laughs> that would be not fun. Because I have a, all of a sudden a T-Rex show up. Our Carnotaurus, I think I could take, unless it was like max level. If a Carnotaurus was max level, then we might have a problem. I think it would be easier to get followed up here, really. Because there's so many rocks down there. Let me just sit here and let everybody catch up. What did he get caught on? I got caught on something. There he goes. He's climbing over the rocks. There he comes. There they come. Almost there. All right, here we are. Home sweet home. All right, I don't want you following me right now, so you just wait right there. You're three minutes, and you won't care. How are you doing? Oh, you're out of berries. Okay, well, take those. All right, um, hmm. so I need uh, fiber, hide, and wood, and I can make a trike engram, a trike saddle. So make me one of those. All right. How are we doing on things? He's eaten, yeah, he done ate through all of those already. All right, I'm just gonna stuff the uh, berries in him then. Except for the stem berries, of course. Uh, I don't need that up anymore. I think that's all my berries I have right now, so. Yeah, there's a hungry, hungry dino here. It's a hungry, hungry dino. Oh, this is also just a blueprint. I thought it was a saddle, but it's just a blueprint for a Fiona. Kind of cool, but not really what we want. Also, let me uh, switch back to regular arrows. All right. So this is going to won't care in a minute and 27. So let's just sit here and wait for this to do. Definitely want to do some imprint, imprinting. I don't know why they call when you tame a baby, it says it's imprinted. It's not imprinted yet. When you tame a baby. That's not how it works. <laughs> you actually have to do the care of uh, whatever it wants. It's slowly eating the food. We'll uh, hopefully it just, it'll just want cuddles. If it wants a certain berry, we can try and get it a berry. It could just want to go for a walk. In fact, I'll make it follow me. In case it does want to go for a walk. It can want some food. It could want some head fedding. It can want some uh, cuddling. It can want some walking. I think there's a couple of other things. I'm not sure. The easiest, of course, is the cuddles. Because you just hit E on it and then you can cuddle it. Hand feeding is fine. You just got to have what it wants. So you, uh, usually a herbivore wants the berries. The meat eaters want some type of meat. All right. So what do you want? 
hand fed mange berry. Okay. There we go. And now it's 100% imprint. I have it set up where um, imprinting once gives 100% imprinting. It, it makes it so much easier um, to do the timing of things. Because if I had done this, I would, if I hadn't done 100% imprinting, I would have had to change the maturation speed so much that it would be a guesswork if I could get it set up correctly. So I just went with, uh, it will give a 100% maturation, I mean 100% imprinting on one cuddle and the maturation happens within like 10 minutes. Okay, so I'm going to want you to stick around here. Let's get on our raptors. Let's head out and see what's out there. Um, are y'all still attacking my target? Yes. Uh, wait. This is just attacking target. You are attacking your target. Um, attack my target. There we go. Attacking your target. Attacking your target. Great. All right. Ooh. Allosauruses are here. A pack of them as well. Interesting. Two of them. Well, there's two of them, but still. That's going to be a whole issue, isn't it? I'm surprised that there's like... This is supposed to be like the starter island. I wasn't expecting like Carnotaur... I wasn't expecting Allosauruses and Carnor and Carnos and... Uh, and um, T-Rexes to show up over here. I didn't think they could. I thought this was supposed to be like the starter island. And you couldn't get things like that. Uh, Triceratops attacking. Ah. Yeah, I think that one bit off more than it can chew. <laughs> There's the redwoods right over there. But that's okay. We're still, it's still going to be a while. I'm, I'm going to want to settle, set up some type of metal, um, metal farming and things like that. So, yeah, it's going to be a while. Yeah, that's nice, but kind of move. I'd love to have him, but, yeah, that's not going to happen. Maybe a parasaur and a parasaur. I could head out and set up on an island. There are a couple of islands around here, like that right there, that I could go out and set up on. Um, it would definitely keep me safe. That's a like a really tiny baby. It must have been just born, like, I don't know, a minute ago. <laughs> Yeah, it's going to, I'm going to have to do something because I, I just wasn't expecting like Allosauruses, T-Rexes, and Carnos being over here. So, I'm going to have to figure out something to do to get protected from them. I, I think I'm going to set up on an island uh, first thing, like over there or something. That's actually the biggest one I've seen so far. It would be kind of nice to set up over there, wouldn't it? long as it's not going to be, I might not be able to use part of it because it's a drop area, you know, so. That's going to be a thing. Yeah. 
So, Allosauruses. Great if I can tame them, because I could use some bigger meat eaters, personally. I don't think I can make a saddle yet for them, though. I don't think I can make a saddle for Allosauruses yet. I think I could do like a Carno, can I? I could do a Sarko, but that's not going to help me out, really. Stego. Okay, so we can't get a Stego. Interesting. I didn't think we could get a Stego. Um, and this isn't going to be all of them, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think this is going to be all of them. Because uh, some of them I need to make in the... Uh, bench. Equus, saddle, Procoptodons. I got a mantis saddle. <laughs> okay. Um, a mammoth one. Terror bird, Dotodicarus, Sarko, Anklio, Sabertooth, Petrodon, Pelagornis, Dunclotaurus, Dire Bears, Mantis, Carnos, yeah, Carnos, Megalodons, and Baryonyx. Yeah, I can't make the, uh, can't make the, uh, saddle for, uh, the Allosaurus yet. I think that's like, it's before the T-Rex, and I think the T-Rex is in the 70s. Oh, shit. What the hell? What are you doing over here? You better not have eaten my baby. Well, whatever. I'm getting rid of you. You're an Allosaurus. It's level 135, though, so I'm probably going to lose a raptor. Hopefully not much. Okay, got him. Whoo! What the hell are you doing down here? How's my... Oh, that's probably why. Uh, he's almost done. Alright, let's check on this thing. So the ones that have the deals are actually supposed to be pretty good. But it's got a descendant torch, so that's actually pretty decent here. Uh, Stemberry seeds, seeds, flags, we're not going to worry about. I'll take that. Don't need this non-reusable spears. I'll take those seeds and some more meat, which is nice. Okay. Not the greatest one of those I've ever seen. Um, let's get on the big guy here and follow me. Follow me. I think he got like damaged or something a little bit, but I think he's fine. I think he ran away because he's a baby. He should be on automatic flee. He should be automatic flee on uh, deals. So, all right, let me throw these things in here. All right, so he's at 75%. It's going to take another, like, five minutes or so. Um, we should have enough time for him to grow up before we leave for the evening. Um, we have we have over 1,000 health right now, and we do have some attack. I'm going to go ahead and pop up your health, though. Definitely, if we're going to start phasing off against... Carno, uh, Allosauruses and shit. Alright, can I make the... Yes, I can. Okay. So I can make the raw, the healing meat. I think I'm going to do that real quick. Okay, so I have that. Let's go back and get up to 400 weight. And then start pumping up my health to 300. Um... 
So let me grab all this stuff. Oh, I have a recipe. Meat jerky. Thanks. Alright. So let me see what I can do here. 791 meat is not bad. 10 prime meat as well, but that's going to spoil before I can use it. So let me split this in half. And then let me split this one in half. And I can put this off in here. And you can have this thing. And then um, the rest of it can be turned into healing meat. Craft all 39. Okay. And then if I put this off in here, his health is at 1120. And if I feed him one of those, it goes up. Gives a nice little jump. Uh, if you watch the regular meat, not bad, but not the greatest. So the he the healing meat is better. It's not healing anymore. That's interesting. Doesn't show it as a buff, which is interesting. We're just going to make him eat another one. How are you doing on berries? You are out of berries. Okay, that's not good. I'm going to have to get you some food. Before you die. Your food's at 6,000. So you should be okay until you grow up. So, But I'm going to go ahead and get you some extra bear food. health. I'm going to go ahead and just go straight for 400 health. I think I have enough berries for until he grows up now. Nope, don't take it to Narco Berries. Hopefully there's enough berries in here until he grows up. We'll see. What is that? Is that a packy? That's a packy. Damn, cool. I wasn't expecting a packy source to be in here. Cool. That's a that's actually a good spawn. That I think that place replaced the Allosaurus around. Or the turtle either the turtle or the Pachysaurus replaced the Allosaurus spawn. So, how are you doing? You're at 83%. Okay. Doesn't look like the Allosaur other Allosauruses are coming down here, which is good. Because that's annoying if they did. I definitely, I don't think I would win against both of those. I would have to do some type of trickery, I think. All right.
compies. Eighty-four. <laughs> this is going to take a while. Um, actually, he is not going to mature before the end of this video, which is unfortunate. Oh, there's a there's a turtle baby. One forty. So you're one forty, are you? That is interesting. We could get us a one forty turtle. Sir tanks a lot. <laughs> No, nah, I would let y'all name him. But if not, I would call him Sir Tanks a lot. Because he gonna have some health on him. The only thing better would be a 150. Ooh. Y'all see that out in the water right there? Is that a... Is that a... Spino? Damn, that's gonna be a... Or is that a turtle? It could be a turtle. I think it's a turtle. Yeah, it's a it's a turtle. Okay. I was worried it was a damn spino. Cause that would be annoying. <laughs> but as soon as we get this guy, then we'll start getting uh narcos in uh in piles. And we can start using the higher tier narcos as well. Um and things like that. But that's my whole thing right now is getting this guy up so I can get the narco berries in bulk and start making trank arrows in bulk and make the higher tier trank arrows as well. It's going to be a lot of, it's going to help me a whole lot to any tames I need to do. <sighs> but we also probably, I don't know if it'll be next episode, but with the, either next episode or the episode after, we'll probably move over to one of these islands out here. And take a look around. Some that's some lightning right there. Some red lightning. That's not good. <laughs> you don't want to see red lightning. The the regular lightning is bad enough. Why the hell would you want to see red lightning? It is an interesting though that there's a storm. A, a rainstorm. Kind of nice. But he's going he's gonna to take a little while, so I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Yeah, he's only at 89%. He's got another, like, five, six minutes to go before he's done. But I'm going to just hang around here on the server before I take a break for a little bit. And I will um, get this guy fully matured up, get a saddle on him, and probably go and do some berry farming so he can have some food. But we'll do the majority of our berry farming uh, next episode. And also probably, maybe, go and live, get one of these islands set up as a home. So we can get that going. And then we can just come over here when we need to to find some tames. Like, uh, probably one of our next big tames is going to be um, a flyer, uh, a petrodon, I think, is going to be our next big tame. So we'll see. So I want to thank everybody for watching. We'll be back next time with more Arc Ascended. Y'all have a nice time, whatever time it is in y'all's part of the world. Bye.